Oh, my screen's dirty. Hang on. Who snotted on that? Ew. Is that you? Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Morning. Nathan and I are both ill. I'm feeling a bit rough. But we promised you guys a reveal. And so, that is what today's video is. <laughs> we have just out, turned out neither of the ponies that you guys are wanting to see today, so no. we're just going to go back and uh, introduce you. Yay! Yay! Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Bye. <laughs> Yay. So, this is Jack. Jack is our new lone pony. Yep. He's 23 year old uh, American Court horse. He is. Jack, would you like to say hello to the vlog? Jack's a bit angry because he has to wear a muzzle because he's a little bit rotund at the moment. But um, yeah, it is Friday and we picked Jack up on Tuesday. Tuesday. Nathan drove the trailer. Superstar. Thank you. You're welcome. So Jack is staying with us for the winter on loan. He, um, as Nathan said, he's 23, so he's an older boy, but he still has a lot of, lot of life left in him. We just did yeah. our first ride at home and he was such a superstar. So he is actually an ex reigning horse. So he is Western trained um, and is doing very, very well at trying to navigate English riding <laughs> and me trying to figure out all of his buttons. <laughs> They're there. Yeah, we're uh, we're pretty good in walk and trot, but but canter. There's so many buttons. I'm like, I I didn't realise I pressed that. <laughs> Bye, Jack. She charged it very well. <laughs> we're trying. 
Um, so yeah, he's 14 too, and for all of the you on Instagram who guessed the colour, he is in fact a beautiful chestnut boy. He's so handsome. Um, so yeah, he will be staying with us for the winter. We're going to be doing some hacking and some dressage, which is very exciting. Yeah. And um, as you can see, MJ is not here. So just to be really confusing, we have two Jacks. We have Ginger Jack and we have Michael Jackson, who is our patchy pony. Um, we're going to take you down to see him in a minute because um, he's actually moved to the farm literally two minutes down the road. He's literally not this field, but the field over. Um, so we're going to take you down to see him. He's going to be living out for the winter, which yeah. he's actually really happy about, bless him. Yeah, he's already getting fat, so he'll be happy. <laughs> It's not fun. Yeah. Don't say that. So yeah, a, this is our new little boy. His uh, his lovely owner Bob has very kindly allowed us to uh, to loan him for the winter, and um, everybody absolutely loves him already. He's such a sweetheart. Aren't you, Jack? I'm just staring at everything now. From the trees. So MJ has moved literally two minutes down the road, not even that to be honest, to live out at, oh he's gone behind the tree, there he is, um, at this lovely little farm. So he's got this whole field all to himself. Oh and then? And then he's got some lov a lovely neighbour in that field and a couple of mares just behind. Hello baby, good morning. Okay. <laughs> and he is very relaxed out here. Should we put your fly mask on and the fly's being annoying? We bought you some treaties. Oh, oh treaties. Yummy. He is very much enjoying living out. Aren't you sweetheart? A few more. Hello. <laughs> I know, those annoying flies. Should you put your fly mask on and put some fly spray on you? Yeah, <laughs> come on then. Are you just gonna stand there staring? Oh you're so pretty. So Jack's just said no to Nathan. He doesn't want the fly spray. And just walked off. <laughs> oh, bless him. <laughs> oh, pretty boy. I'll get his fly mask. Oh, the head scratches. Loves a head scratch. <laughs> oh, good boy. Yeah, I don't put his mask on before he disappears. <laughs> there we go, fly mask on. Much happier about the flies. 
So yeah, he's literally two minutes down the road. So just literally behind there is the lane. Bye. <laughs> that we drive up to our regular yard with. As you can see, he is very happy doing his own thing. So we still see him every day. Twice a day. Yeah, twice a day. So we normally come down in the morning. He still gets his dinner. So we normally come down in the morning, do turn ponies out at our normal yard and then come down and see him, make sure he's all okay. He's actually eaten most of what we gave him, isn't he? He's never been a very good eater, but he yeah. is actually eating really well. But he has got a whole field full of grass, so he's pretty happy. And then we come down in the evenings as well, give him some food, as well as Jack, and Rug sort him, him needs out. It, and then give yeah. him a cuddle before he chooses to leave us. Yeah. And he's been very chilled, hasn't he? He's um, He comes over to see us, and then he normally kind of is like, just very much like this, and it's just... Just wanders off and does his own thing. He's very happy, bless him. He's but we've enjoying, also he's enjoying the rest. Exactly. Um, but we quite often um, we're still taking taking Jackson for walks and stuff. Um, his feet are looking so good now. He's been barefoot since he was retired, and we've got him some boots because he's been a little bit foot sore. sore. Um, so he comes out for walks with Jack in hand. I'll pop a few of like the clips of that as well. They absolutely love each other, obviously. They're both very, very similar, very sweet personality horses. Um, so yeah, we take, we're taking them both for like walks together um, so that Jackson... Oh, it's going to get very confusing with two Jacks. Um, so that Jackson still gets to be involved in stuff. Oh, here he comes. We don't have any more food for you, sorry. <laughs> Hi. So yeah, he still very much gets to be involved. He comes out for walks with us all the time. Um, and once we've got Jack out hacking, hi baby, um, we're gonna take this lovely boy in hand. Hey, sure you get to come with us? You're such a good boy. So yeah, this is our current situation and obviously um so the plan is for jack to go back in the springtime um and then jackson will come back to the yard and um back to normal routine um but we just thought it would be really nice for him to be able to live out for the winter um because he does um oh okay we're playing with the buckets we do at our yard go into five hours turnout to rest the fields and we were just worried that he might struggle because of his leg problems. He does get quite stiff when he's in the stable for quite a lot and so we thought actually it just seemed like the perfect opportunity for both of them. Um, Jack gets to come down and you know have a bit of a change and be ridden regularly and do some fun stuff with somebody and then Jackson gets to come out and just kind of live live his best life out in the field for a bit. Don't you? Hey, good boy. So yeah, that is the update you've all been waiting for. I will obviously have put in clips of the day that we went and got Jack um, and our first, first ride at home. We didn't actually video the first ride that we did at Bob's yard. Um, it was all, we all got a bit distracted and we didn't really film it. Bye Jackson, love you.
so I will pop in all the clips that I've got um, and obviously you will be seeing a lot more of both of these boys so yeah keep an eye on updates um, but yeah All there's good. our update two ponies crazy isn't it yep no, well, madness. we've got to get to work yeah we've got to get to work but anyway thank you very much for watching this video Nathan what do they need to do uh, comment with any questions points Life stories. Life stories. Uh, like, don't mind life stories. And subscribe. Yeah. Oh, subscribe. Oh. Goodbye, Jackson. We love you. <laughs> so, yeah. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Bye. You're going to need to help me. I don't have enough hand. Oh, so poorly. I got the cold. He's got the cold.